everybody, this is Phil, and I'm back with another video. Right now, I'm going to show you how to manually update your Nexus 10 manually, the 4.4 KitKat. First off, you're going to go download the file in the description, which will be a zip file, which is the actual update. Um, you want to have ADB. This right here is on Mac, but it also will work on Windows the same exact way. But you want to have ADB. The link for that will also be in the description. Um, the folder, you would want to go into the SDK folder right here. Platform tools. Put that zip file to update in this folder. And you want to go ahead and open your terminal. Go ahead and open your terminal if you're in Windows, it's command prompt. Go ahead and change the directory. CD. And then you're going to drag the platform tools folder in here. Either that way, go ahead and hit enter. Okay, now you're in that folder. Okay, what you want to do is turn the Nexus 10 off. Hold all three buttons at the same time. Here comes to this screen right here. And then what you want to do is just go down, try and button. So you see recovery mode, go ahead and hit the power button. You just come to this screen right here. And basically what you want to do is Hold the power button and the volume down button for a couple seconds. Okay, then you come to here. Now what you want to do, plug it into your computer. Now back on the computer, after you plug it in and did all this and you're on this screen, on your Nexus 10. Oh yeah, by the way, this will also now on the Nexus 4, the Nexus 7, and probably the Nexus 5 too. If any updates. Um, go back to your terminal. What you want to do here is type in dot backslash ADB. And ADB or whatever it says right there, what you type in. Slash ADB space silo, and then what you want to do is go back into that folder where I told you to paste the update, and it's basically copy the name, so you can just paste it in here. Then what you want to do if you paste this, hit enter. And then it will push it to your device. As you can see here. Okay, it's done. Now it's very fun update package. Prepare for your current system. Shouldn't really take that long.
about halfway done. And after you do that, you're done with the computer. It's just so easy as that. Basically, what this is for, if you want to update sooner, you don't want to wait for them to push it to your particular device. This is an easy way to do it. Once the um, update files are released, just go ahead and um, update them yourself manually. Because I know there's probably a lot of people out there waiting for KitKat for the next four, for the next seven. So it's just an easier way to do it. And it's just about done. I'm just going to reboot after this. There we go. We want to um, go ahead and hit the power button and we'll reboot. As you can see right there, that is the new logo, boot animation. Rather, and of course, just going to update some Android apps. Well, optimized apps. Just go ahead and unplug that. There we go. As you can see, there it is white. The only thing is, I wish the um, navigation bar and the navigation bar was transparent, but evidently it's not transparent on tablets, only on the Nexus 5 as of right now. Jump in here to settings. As you can see, 4.4. This is the Nexus 10. Here's a little Easter egg, the K. And there we have it, Android 4.4. Jump back in here real quick. There we have it. Android KitKat installed the manual way in your Nexus 10. It's very simple. If you want to do it, go ahead and do it. There's really no risk. It's the official update. And that's about it for this video. Go ahead and give me a thumbs up if you like the video. And subscribe for more videos if you haven't already. And I'll see you in the next one.